get over to Jed Castles. Yeah. Jed, pretty incredible video. I heard that uh, meter had all kind of colors with it, too. So okay. just a, absolutely fascinating. Good stuff there. Hey, let's check out your bus stop weather here out the door this morning. It is a cold start, so make sure your bus stoppers are prepared. Got the gloves, the stocking cap, the coat this morning. It's going to be a cold one, but I'll tell you, your afternoon looks really nice. A lot of sunshine on the way, and we're looking at uh, 56 for high coming up this afternoon. So nice, pleasant forecast here later today. We're tracking a storm just to our west. That'll be coming our way as we head into Saturday. As we look at our forecast by next Tuesday, that's our next storm. That could be a bigger storm. We'll be tracking that closely as it rolls our way. So a bit more action coming our way. What we need is moisture, and so we're hoping for the best. We can get some of that coming our way. Right now, all the advisories are up toward north and west, so this winter storm is coming out with the highest totals expected from parts of Colorado, New Mexico, up into Kansas, so we're monitoring that. Right there along the Kansas border, we have some advisories. This storm is going to hug the Oklahoma-Kansas border, so if you live up near Buffalo, near Laverne, up near Alva, don't be surprised. You might get a little snowfall. We'll check your snowfall totals here coming up in just a moment. Right now, 32. Uh, north winds putting the wind chill at 29. Cold start this early morning as we check the future cast here. Watching the storm coming out of the Rockies. Areas of snow moving through the southern Rockies into your Friday as we go into tonight. That storm moves across. Watch the rain develop. That'll set up later tonight into tomorrow morning by 6 a.m. Rain chances start to move in. Mainly a light rain coming in as this round comes across some areas of snow, maybe some heavy snow, wet snow up along the Kansas border, mainly snowing up into Kansas as that moves across. And then as this upper low kind of lumbers right across Oklahoma, we'll have some rain moving in. Now the cold part of this storm is going to roll right over Oklahoma. So while we have some rain, sometimes run underneath that cold core that can transition over to some heavy wet snowflakes. Sometimes you get accumulation with that, so we'll monitor that. That'll come in late tomorrow with the ground temperatures being so warm. I don't see any major issues, but don't be surprised at that by Sunday morning. It's out of here. Move it out. So our weather today looks great. Got some sunshine on the way. A few clouds this morning. Sunshine through the afternoon and temperatures rebounding up in the 50s here later today. Hey, are you feeling your allergies today? We're monitoring that allergy count because cedar pollen starts to kick back in this time of the year. It is reporting in the moderate category. It's cold this morning, 19 currently Woodward, 32 OKC, 35 in Ardmore. Winds are pretty light, so wind chill, not a major issue, but if you step outside, you may feel some wind chills in the teens across parts of northern Oklahoma, 20s elsewhere here starting off this morning. Forecast highs today, again, ranging through the 50s, closing in on 60 in southern parts of Oklahoma. Overnight tonight, we'll bottom out in the 30s. So it's going to be a cold night tonight, some 40s as well. But we'll warm it back up tomorrow. So mainly a rain event here for Oklahoma City. A cold rain starting out tomorrow morning with some rain and some snow in northwest Oklahoma. Those snow chances in the north will continue, but they'll gradually come to an end. Again, rain expected here in the central parts, but don't be surprised late tomorrow into tomorrow evening. A few snowflakes may be mixing in with that rainfall. Rainfall totals, for the most part, are going to be light. We're talking trace to maybe up to a quarter of an inch. If you get more than a quarter of an inch, consider yourself the lottery winner. This is going to be mainly a lighter system. And the snowfall amounts for most locations will be light. No major issues in the white here. But up in the north, you might get a little snowfall tomorrow morning, maybe enough to make those roadways a bit slushy. So we'll monitor that up near the Kansas border. Temperatures tomorrow rebounding, 30s, 40s, 50s, even closing on 60 in southwest parts of Oklahoma. So we're tracking a potential winter storm coming in next Tuesday and Wednesday. The track on this has it moving to the southern Rockies, rolling right up across Texas into southern Oklahoma. So the opportunity is there for some snowfall, maybe some pretty good snowfalls. So we'll track that heading into next week. Some chances of rain tomorrow, 100% may end with a little snow tomorrow night. And the next system comes in on Tuesday may linger on into early Wednesday with some areas of snow looking possible. Turning colder, got those highs in the 30s and 40s early next week. Lacey Scott, 